Hey guys, on today's video, we're going to be updating your iPad to the latest OS. So let's just go right into your settings. Under your settings, you will see your very first option where it says tech and design in this case. That's the name of my iPad. However, your iPad could have a different name or whatever your name is, plus a picture beside it. Go right into there, go into iCloud and make that backup on iCloud. Then what we're going to do is just go right into general. Under general, we're going to see our second option where it says software update. And from there, it should say iPad OS 13.4, which is almost a gig, 796.1 megabytes. So this means it's going to take quite a bit of time for some of you to download this. For others with faster internet speed, you're only looking at a couple minutes of download plus the installation time. So we're just going to click on download and install. If you guys have a passcode, it's going to ask you for that passcode right now. Once we put that in, our download will start. If you guys have 50% of your battery, you're good to go. You guys can go ahead and update. However, even if you guys have 90% of your battery, I highly suggest hooking it up to some electricity. That way it's charging and when the installation starts, nothing bad will happen. When it's downloading and it turns off, it's no big deal. However, if it turns off when it's installing, then you will have to restore. And that's why I suggested making that backup. If you guys run out of space on your iCloud with those five free gigs, then don't worry about it. Hook it up to your computer. Or even if you guys are having problems with this update in general, you guys can hook it up to your computer just using your USB cable and then update it using iTunes, which is a free program for your PC. If you guys are on Mac, you guys can just use Finder in order to update and back up your iPad. So right now we're just gonna wait until this is done downloading and then we have to install. For some of you, you may see install already and not the download. That's because you already downloaded the OS and all we have to do is install. Once it's done downloading, all we have to do is click on install now. And there we go, it's gonna verify the update and then we will see this Apple logo plus a loading bar. The first Apple logo and loading bar are gonna go really slow. The second Apple logo and loading bar you will see, it's gonna be a lot faster. And once that's done, our update is done. After that, it's gonna ask you for your passcode if you guys have one. Once you put that in, there you go. We are all done. So for most of you, this will last about 10 to 20 minutes, the update. For some of you that have faster internet, sure, it could only take 10 minutes installation plus download time, and that would be it. If you guys there are stuck for two hours or longer, then just hook it up to your computer, use iTunes if you guys have PC in order to update it and even do the backup. Or if you guys have Mac, you guys can use Finder in order to update and make that backup. That's it for this video. If you guys have any comments, questions, you guys can write down here in the comments area and don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.